Welcome back to Andrew Jean Cleaning. Today I'm going to show you how to whiten up your Tupperware. Maybe you left some pizza sauce or spaghetti sauce in there and you wash it and it turned all red, you all. I microwaved this for a long time and I left it on my counter for a long time. But we're going to be doing two little experiments here today. We're going to be using a little of Dawn dish soap. And if you are brand new to the pink stuff, this is not sponsored by the way. This stuff is amazing. This is the experiment. Here's what we're going to do. You're going to take some hot water. You're going to put it in your Tupperware where you have the red stains. You can do this with brand new stains. You can do this with stains that are many, many years old. You're gonna just put a little dish soap in there. And then here's the secret ingredient. You're gonna take a little paper towel. You're gonna put that on in there, put a lid on it, and then we're gonna give it a good shake. Shakey, shake, shake, shakey, 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 shake, 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 shake. Now we're gonna let that sit for just a hot second. Now we're gonna go in today with the pink stuff. I've used this on so many different things. Uh, windows, grout, microwaves, you name it. I have an entire video on this. So we're gonna get that good and lathered up. Let's just see how this one's gonna compare to this one right here. I'm gonna go in here. Ooh, that is stuck, stuck stuck up all up in there. Ooh, look at that. Caked, caked in there. Ooh, ooh, I'm gonna need to get another paper towel. Ta-da, here we go. Let's just really get, get some of those good stuff in there. Here we go. Oh, and if you wanna know, this is right here. 99% natural ingredients, environmentally non-toxic, non-hazardous formulation, not tested on animals. Let's go in with this pink stuff, right? I've cleaned out my sink with this. I've cleaned shoes with this. Wow, that's bad in there. I'm gonna go in just one more coat here, really get that well, and then we're gonna check on this one right here, and I'll let you know which one actually cleans up better. All right, pretty good coat on there. Set that aside. Ooh, do you guys see that? See that? See it's coming off the sides right there? Wow, let's shake it again. All right, here we go. Open that up. Let's see. Now, if this is really bad, you might wanna do this a couple times and let it sit longer. Oh, let's see. Wow, you guys. Look at that. Wow. That's impressive. Okay, let me rinse this out quick. Rinsed it out. You can see it's got still a red tinge to it. So we're going to try the paper towel one more time and see if it gets the remaining off. Now let's go ahead and rinse this off and see what it looks like compared to this. Survey says, all right, so I'm not impressed with that either. Now again, I did not let anything sit on there. Let's try it one more time. We're going to leave the pink stuff alone. We're going to put some warm water back in here again. I'm going to let it sit for five minutes. I'm going to again put some paper towel in there. That seems about good. I'm gonna put the lid on. I'm gonna get a little bit of shaky shaky again. Five minutes, let's come back and see if the rest of this red stuff is off as compared to this one, still stuck on there. Well, that's sitting, do you see this bottle? It's all tainted red. Let's just, let's just do something for funsies, shall we? Let's put this in here. Not that we really care if this bottle is red, but I wanna see how well this actually works. I'm gonna roll this up. I'm gonna twist this, I'm gonna pop it down inside right here, put the cap on, and I'll let this sit. This one I'm not even gonna wipe down or scrub because uh, it's gonna to be too difficult, so let's just see. Our time is up, let's see where we're at, y'all. I'm feeling confident here, I'm feeling confident. Let's just open this up super quick and see. Ooh, okay, let me rinse it out. Survey says, you all, that was a bus. That thing is still tinted red. TikTok, you lied. All you other people making videos about this hack, you lie, you lie, you lie. So here we are with some hydrogen peroxide. My goal is to save you the most amount of time possible. I'm just gonna get this all along the walls right in here, okay? I'm gonna let this sit for a hot minute, see what happens. And this, by the way, this probably is not gonna work, but let's just dump it out and see. Lies, you all, they're all lies. It's still tainted red. Took a peek on it right here. I think this is doing the trick. For little funsies, I'm gonna add a little baking soda to this mixture right here. Let that work its magic. Let's give it about five minutes. Let's take a peek here. Hydrogen peroxide, you all, I think this did 
the best job. Let me just dump this in here. You're better off making a paste, so I would do a baking soda hydrogen peroxide paste. The more red and stained your Tupperware, whatever your is, um, is, I would let it sit on there for longer. And again, I'm not scrubbing, that's just some paper towel. See the red tint? And this is what it looked like before. Yes, so it, there's just a tiny bit of tint left, but again, I just let it sit there for about five minutes. Let's look in the inside right here. Yes, much better. Don't waste your time with just putting a little Dawn dish soap and shaking vigorously for 45 seconds in hot water. I don't think it's gonna cut it for you, depending upon how stained it is. Save yourself some time, hydrogen peroxide, a little baking soda paste, let it sit on there and rinse. And just to save you some time and effort, I tried WD-40. I tried some soft scrub with bleach. I also tried these magic eraser sheets. I tried these two in combination and they all worked, I mean, relatively the same. And just for fun, I tried OxyClean. Yeah, about the same results of all of these things above. All right, if you enjoyed this video, I hope that you will give it a thumbs up so that I can reach more people. My goal is to save you time, energy, and share the best cleaning tips, hacks, and tricks with you. Share it to Facebook and Pinterest and sign up for the weekly newsletter, and I will see you, my friend, in the next one.